to drive You learned to swim You learned to lie Keep some things within You yeah, learned so, to everyone, to rise Today marks my first day of preparation for the exams week October 9 is around 2.40 PM. The reason why I prepare a week before my exams is because of the coverage. My goal is to read twice per subject. I couldn't retain all the technical legal information if I only read once. So, kailangan talaga twice, guys. My first two scheduled subjects for midterms are CRIM criminal law and constitutional law we don't have an exam for civil procedure this um the same week as the other subjects because it was rescheduled and there's no particular date yet as to when we'll take the exam <laughs> grabe guys akong tunok sa akong heart kay nawala gyud gamay at least in my opinion civil procedure is one of the hardest technical subjects in law school and to think that it's given to us first year law students for those who are law students as well if you have tips on how you study for civ pro please comment down below i can use some advice because yun nga, i'm still adjusting and i'm still trying to figure out how to study effectively for Civ Pro. I'm gonna share more of my schedule on the next few days in this vlog. October 17. Guys, what I did the entire day yesterday after coming back here at my boyfriend's place from my cream exam, I ate my dinner and slept. I just slept from 10 p.m. to 6. So I had a lot of sleep today. And it's kind of unusual given that it's midterms week i don't usually sleep but yesterday while i was taking my cream exam my head was hurting you guys sakit kaya kung oh when well, i answer ko sa exam it's probably because i didn't have sleep yesterday i did have three hours of sleep but then you know it's not enough okay, at 6 30 i'm gonna be starting my review for consti this is gonna be our first major exam because we didn't have our pre-midterms so we don't really have like an idea as to how the questions are gonna be asked aside from studying you also have to kind of like familiarize how questions are formulated so that you know how to study more strategically but what we're doing what wait what i'm personally doing is you know i just read the entire coverage last week and then now I have like 8 hours, 8 to 9 hours. Because our consti exam is gonna be at 5.30 this afternoon and it's still 6 a.m. So I think I still have time to review and familiarize everything. Go back and probably just skim. Because I already made my notes last week. So that's the advantage if you read ahead 
so we have to do this review. So yeah. It's 2 p.m. 2.04 p.m. And um, I'm gonna get ready in a while. I've been reading since 6.30? 6.30 a.m. Honestly, my eyes hurt. And that's probably the only reason why I print out some of my notes. But for subjects nga dagan ko memorize and all that, um, delete na lang ko mag print sa kong notes because sayang ang paper. <sighs> what else? I go to school around 3 p.m. So I have an hour. Siguro I'll start getting ready at 2.30. I have 23 minutes to study. So I'm gonna get going. Keep on sinking. Surprise committee. Let's go. Let's imagine that it's fire. Happy birthday to you. These are my save notes for Consti PowerPoint presentations that are provided by our prof. Notes. Ayan. I made this last week. See, this is why I love good notes. It's just one whole page and then you can write a lot of things. I'm back here in my house. Um, the reason why I'm back here is because my mom visited me. So if you guys didn't know yet, I live alone and I can just you know like go to uh, my boyfriend's house for example um in the case na wala koy wifi here sa house like now out of all the times kay karon jud wala wifi sa house every time that my schedule comes slightly loose i tend to forget about my wifi so <laughs> Anyway, I will be using my data. I was planning to take a nap, but I don't feel like sleeping yet. I feel like I have to replace my prescription glasses every sem. I have a friend who has an eye strain because of studying, probably. Rose Lane, shout out to you, girl. You know, I always say to myself na I will get used to the grind and that everything will be worth it at the end of the day. Good morning guys, I was able to finish reading two cases out of five. So all I did the past days for a fellow is to read our notes that me and my group mates made. And right now it's almost 10 a.m. and I woke up around 9. And I'll go to school around 3.30 as per usual. The reason why I'm early is because me and my friends usually like discuss it's also really helpful in my opinion because it's a form of active recall and at least i get to have an idea with regards to the topics that i probably missed while i'm studying or i get to have or get to hear new perspectives from them especially that it's philo so this is also one tip that i like to share and you guys probably heard this a lot already especially for those who are interested to go to law school it is very important to find your group of friends. I still have two minutes to talk. When I say friend groups in law school, it's not really like a clique. And like in high school, it's more of a study group. We share our ideas with each other. We keep each other in check. For me, it's really like a tedious process. Some people meet their final group of friends when they reach third year in law school. Trial and error, like I'm so happy and confident with the group of friends that I have in law school right now. And true enough, your friends in law school will help you big time, especially in the dissemination of tasks. It's 10 a.m. so I'll update you guys later. 3 p.m. 
and i finished all the cases oh, this is what i love about good notes you can like play with the colors you can screenshot and transfer it to like a separate notebook good notes is my favorite note taking app so ayan na lahat guys um you can text to speech right here click speak good morning 9:04 a.m guys today we won't be having an exam instead we'll have a catch-up lecture for civil procedure i've been up since 8 a.m that's because we have to go to the bank for midterm for ethics it's gonna be tomorrow and then on Saturday, um, StatCon, Sagittarius Construction. I have to make do of my time today to hopefully um, cover everything. Yes, I'm doing my makeup right now and I will be bashed again because I'm saying that I'm going to makeup, but whatever. I don't want to look lifeless and pale when I go out in public. You know what? I'm just gonna let you judge me because I don't have time anymore to defend myself. Haters gonna hate, potatoes gonna potato. Actually guys, kung ako lang papilion, I don't really wanna wanna go out and do my errands. But because my mom is alone today, I have to go with her. But if it were me, I really just wanna stay home and study because I don't wanna break the momentum. 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 This is gonna be my perfume for today. So the Anario perfume distribute. <laughs> okay. You learn to walk. You learn to breathe. You learn to fight. To get back on your feet. guys a little sit down part of this vlog because i really just you know wanted to clarify some things the previous vlog which is also my first law school vlog i received questions or comments saying that you know i'm so chill for a law student or i wasn't really able to cover the class part the lectures part of being in law school number one on our first week in law school, it's more of a introductory week where we have our ITL or Introduction to Law class. That's equivalent to, if I'm not mistaken, two units. So it's a whole course when you are admitted into first year. So it's really like a separate subject. There's an exam at the end of the week. Hence, this TikTok video na sa kay ko, I mentioned that I had my first exam in law school and this is the exam that i'm talking about for itl and secondly with regards to filming during classes especially the recits part na gusto nyong makita that's unfortunately not allowed i made sure na you know um i'm still abiding the school's laws so guys i've been making vlogs since i was in grade four for fun for entertainment if there's someone who's so conscious about the things that's being put out there in the internet that's probably me because my heart and my intentions are always pure always will be i've been saying this since 2017 also for everyone's peace of mind especially mine i have approached the school's department to make sure that you know i'm not crossing any boundaries i affirmed naman um i really made sure guys because sobra uso ngayon sa sa tiktok ang mga content creators who are in law school they're being talked about in reddit i'm always on reddit i love reddit it's my favorite platform in the world i just wanted to clarify because of that and so long as i am doing my own thing with clear intentions in mind i think i'm good and i think we're all good so long as we're not doing anything bad i upload videos on youtube mainly because i really just want to help 
those who are aspiring law students because guys i was one of those young girls and boys who only dreamed of studying law i've been looking forward to this since i was in junior high school i just to assert of how respectful and how responsible i'm trying to be so i think that's all guys i really just wanna re-establish the purpose and uh, the reason why i upload videos on the internet and maybe grab this opportunity as well to thank everyone who has been supporting so so happy and so grateful that you guys are still here um we've come a long way and we still have a long way to go so thank you time check it is 201 it's time to study and i'm gonna talk to you guys later traditional pen and paper anymore i don't know in other law schools we are actually using the same software that is used in the bar exam so we use exemplify for our midterms and finals for our pre-midterms and pre-finals we don't necessarily have to use that it depends on the prof i'm gonna have to wake up early tomorrow because i have to do some daughter duties my mom will leave me again actually she's only here to make sure that i eat during my exam week Tiranggat juga ikut ni ya guys. Hi. The children have followed the footsteps of their father. They're stuck in the desert. Only they have the work of the kind mother who says when he gets bad, fail. He has studied greatly yet has never learned a smidgen of a single thing. They had met when they were younger but are now far gone and she morphs into a frail thing, a frail thing. You know what? My eye bags are so intense and you guys will have to get used to that my eye bags will always be like this today is a sunday it's october 22 this is finally the sunday that i've been looking forward to since two weeks ago and i actually promised myself now i'm not gonna stress out today and i'm not gonna use much of my brain as a way to give it a break She's been working hard for me. <laughs> Golfing with Herdy and Ryle. And disclaimer, I just started learning. I'm literally at the at the learning how to grip properly part. So don't don't quote me for anything. Yesterday was fun. It was fun. Um, we had drinks at 88th Avenue from from Cebu. You guys know where 88th is. So we just enjoyed and then I swear I slept for 12 hours. Slept at 9, woke up at 9 a.m. this morning. It was my first time going out with my friends in law school. So that's a first for us. Yeah, today is a do-nothing day. I'm so excited. Guys, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you all.